Hello, it's me, the ukulele teacher, and as you may have noticed, Valentine's Day is coming up soon. And what better way to win the heart of a loved one than by serenading them with a ukulele song. So with that in mind, I've created a Valentine's Day playlist, so go ahead and check it out. Plus, I asked on Twitter what would be a great romantic song to learn, and the best reply I got was Can't Take My Eyes Off Of You by Andy Williams. So, grab your uke, make sure it's in tune, and get ready to learn Can't Take My Eyes Off Of You. This song is split up into three distinct sections. The verse, the chorus, and the little instrumental bit that goes in between. So, just in case you've never heard it before, I'm going to play you through each of those sections quickly first to give you a rough idea of what it should sound like when you've learned it. You're just too good to be true Can't take my eyes off of you You feel like heaven to touch I wanna hold you so much you'll need for the song. It seems like a lot, but there's a lot of cool little tips and tricks to help you move between the chords to make it easier to learn. If you already know them, skip ahead now. To play the chord of C, put your third finger on the third fret of the first string. And the chord of C should sound like this. To move from C to C major 7, just put your second finger on the second fret of the first string. And C major 7 should sound like this. To move from C major 7 to C7, just put your first finger on the first fret of the first string, and C7 should sound like this. So your first three chords are C, C major 7, and C7. To play the chord of F, move your first finger from the first fret of the first string to the first fret of the second string, then add your second finger to the second fret of the fourth string, and the chord of F should sound like this. To play the chord of F minor, put your first finger on the first fret of the fourth string, your second finger on the first fret of the second string, and your fourth finger on the third fret of the first string. And the chord of F minor should sound like this. To play the chord of D7, bar the second fret with your first finger. That means you push down on all four strings at the same time. Then add your second finger to the third fret of the first string. And the chord of D7 should sound like this. And to play the chord of D minor 7, go back to that F shape, then add your third finger to the second fret of the third string, and your fourth finger to the third fret of the first string. And the chord of D minor 7 should sound like this. To play the chord of G, put your first finger on the second fret of the third string, and your second finger on the second fret of the first string. Then add your third finger to the third fret of the second string. And the chord of G should sound like this. And to play the chord of A7, put your first finger on the first fret of the third string. And the chord of A7 should sound like this. The strumming pattern is a nice and soft, nice and simple, down, down, up, up, down, up. The pattern is the same all the way through the song, and you play it pretty much twice on each chord, unless I say otherwise. The first three lines of the verse are C to C major 7 to C7. So let's play that down, down, up, up, down, up pattern twice on each of those chords. Down, down, up. Up, down, up, down, down, up, 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 up, down, up. Now that you've got the pattern, you've also got the first three lines of the verse. You're just too good to be true. Can't take my eyes off of you. You feel like heaven to touch. Then the next three lines are F to F minor to C, and again, keep playing down, down, up, up, down, up, twice on each of those chords. I wanna hold you so much, 
At long last, love has arrived And I thank God I'm alive You're just too and then the final two lines are D7 to D minor 7 and then finish on the C. But here we just play the strumming pattern once on the D7 and the D minor 7 and then twice on that C. You're just too good to be true. Can't take my eyes off of you. After verse 1 you go straight into verse 2 which has exactly the same chords and then you go into the instrumental and again that's the same strumming pattern down down up up down up it's two lines d minor 7 to g to c to c and then d minor 7 to g to c to a7 and with the instrumental accompaniment it should sound something like this And now we move on to the chorus. The strumming pattern stays the same, but this time we just play it once on each chord all the way through. The first four chords are D minor 7 to G to C major 7 to A7. I love you baby, and if it's quite alright, I need you baby to warm the lonely nights. And then the final two lines are D minor 7 to G to C to A7. I love you baby, trust me when I say. And from that A7, you go straight into the second half of the chorus. The first four lines are exactly the same. D minor 7 to G to C major 7 to A7. Oh, pretty baby, don't bring me down, I pray. Oh, pretty baby, now that I've found you, stay. But then the final two lines are just D minor 7 to G. And here we play the pattern twice on each of those chords. And let me love you. together and you've got the chorus. Then just play verse 3, the instrumental, and then play the chorus to end. And you've got the entire song. And that's how to play Can't Take My Eyes Off Of You by Andy Williams. I've been the ukulele teacher. If you have any requests for future lessons, let me know in the comments below. Until next time, I love you all and I wish you the best.